Hello everybody, Stark here, and today we're going to be looking at some more of my custom minifigures from Venom, Let There Be Carnage. Now, a few weeks ago when the movie came out, I did make a video where I made Eddie Brock and Cletus Cassidy, so if you want to check that out, I'll link that at the top of the screen, but for now, let's get started with these minifigures. So first up is Cletus Cassidy in his main outfit from the movie. The hair and head pieces are the same that I used for him in that previous video. The hair is from Arthur Weasley and the head is from Loki from Thor Ragnarok. His torso is Hector Barbosa's from Pirates of the Caribbean and his legs are the Rockers from CMF Series 12. Next up is Shriek. Her hair is from Bellatrix Lestrange, that head is from Storm, her torso is Claire's from the first Jurassic World movie but backwards and with reddish brown hands, and then her legs are the Beekeepers from CMF Series 21. Next up is Anne. Her hair is the Vet minifigures from CMF Series 17, that head is Sharon Carter's from Civil War, her torso is from Pepper Potts from the new Iron Monger set, and then her legs are Scarlet Witches from Age of Ultron. And here is Anne when she transforms into Venom. The head is just the standard Venom head. The torso is Ravens from Teen Titans Go, but flipped backwards and with black arms and hands. The legs are just standard black ones. And then I also put a black one by one tile under each foot just to make her a little bit taller. Here is Dan. His hair is Superman's and his head is Bruce Banner's from Thor Ragnarok or Infinity War. And I know he doesn't wear this outfit in Let There Be Carnage, but I think it's his most recognizable outfit from the series. So his torso and leg pieces are both from Dr. Hibbert from the second Simpsons CMF series, but I replaced the hands on the torso with tan ones. Next up here is Detective Mulligan. I got his hair from the Hydra Henchman minifigure from Age of Ultron. That head is Hopper's from Stranger Things. His torso is Nick Fury's from Captain Marvel, but I replaced the hands with tan ones. And then his legs are an Imperial Pilots from Star Wars Rebels. And last but not least, here is Mrs. Chen. Now, I'm pretty sure somebody suggested this minifigure in the comments of one of my previous videos, and I was going to give you a shout out, but for some reason, I can't find that comment anymore. So if that was you, please let me know. Anyway, her hair is Harry Potter's. Her head is Edna Mode's. That torso is Minnie Mouse's from the first Disney CMF series with Daisy's arms from the first Disney CMF series, but I replaced the hands with tan ones. And then you don't really see her legs in the movies because she's always behind the counter. So I just gave her my favorite legs that I've been using a lot lately. Harry Potter's from the second Harry Potter CMF series. All right, everybody, that's going to do it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any suggestions for videos I should make in the future, please let me know down below and I'll give you a shout out if I use your idea. Anyway, come back this Tuesday for a very special video you're not going to want to miss. See you then.